Today, I will show you the order panel of Vike Paws. Here I will show you how to get all sale history from the order list. We can see some tab options. In the first tab, we get the sale history. In the second tab, we get the hold sale. And in the last tab, we get the offline sale. In the sale history, we get a list of order number, process by, outlet name, customer info, date, total, and action. We see in the action there is a details button. Click the button to see all details of the order. Here you can see the full order details. You can print it directly or download it. If you want, you can get any information by searching in the search panel. You can search by outlet, process by, offline ID, order date, and date between. In the Hold Sale tab, you can see the hold list. If you click the Add to Cart button, it will take you to the pause menu. Here you can see all items that you held previously. You click the Pay Now button for payment or you can also clear your cart by clicking the Clear button. If you want, you can add more items to the cart and click on Hold to add that cart to the hold list. By clicking the Remove Form Hold button, you can remove cart from pause and the hold list. In the Offline Sale tab, you can see no record found. If for any reason the internet is disconnected, then you can order offline if the administrator allows offline ordering. Now, we are in offline mode. When you are offline, then we can see only three menu panels. The Sale History tab does not support offline. Now go to pause menu and do some order. In previous videos, I showed how to do order. If you missed that, then click on the I button and watch the video now. Here we see an offline counter button. Click here, it will take you to the offline sale tab. Now you will see the offline sale lists. When you are online, then you can see the offline counter button is decreasing its number. That means all offline orders will go to the Sale History tab. Now check the Sale History tab for seeing the offline order. We can identify offline sales by checking their offline ID. Every offline sales order ID has a OF prefix. That's all about the order panel. Hope you enjoyed this video. Like, comment, share, and subscribe to get more updates.